Hey everyone, thank you for joining me here for another video. So guys, I have gotten in my Black Friday order and then I don't know what the deal is. Every time I get a new order, I feel like I need to reorganize some stuff. So as I was putting everything together, trying to organize everything, I just realized that I should share all my accessories. So the accessories that I'm taking into 2024. All right, so let's start out first with um, page flags. Okay. So I'm going to move some of these things back and over and out of the way. Are y'all ready for this? Here we go. I told you I just got an order in, right? There we go. Page flags. <laughs> so I have a, uh, a couple of uh, different kinds of page flags and colors. So first we have Lux page flags. I love these. So I have a schedule, I have task, and then I also have uh, noted. I've just about gotten all of these to do and record. So these are all the Lux page flags that I have and I use these in my planner in various ways. Uh, one of the things that I like to do is, I'll show you in my planner right here, is sometimes just add it as a tab. I can use them as tabs. If you have a task um, list that's on your plans for the week, you can put tasks next to it. Or if you want it to record something or to do's, I'll just use them inside of my planner and just put it down as noted. Okay. So these are the Lux page flags and these are totally awesome. I, I love using these in my planner. And then we have the new, these are all new guys. Let me see. Yep. These are the new arrow flags right here. The arrows. I went ahead and put some of them on my today tab so I can just grab them. But here, I just use them as, like you say, a page flag, just so I can indicate like this is January and I can indicate right here, this is February. So you can indicate different notes or various places inside of your planner. So what I did, I just used it to show, um, since I don't have monthly um, dividers right now, I just used it to show January, February and March. So that's one way. And these are the newest ones. Like I said, they're transparent and these are so nice. So I use page flags in different ways as well. Here's one on my notebook. Just put one right here on my notebook, just to indicate where that page was that I'm actually using right there. Okay. And then next we have these square page flags. I love the square page flags. Let me see if I've used one. They work perfectly, perfectly in the calendar section. So let me show y'all. So here we go. This is how I use the page flags. They work perfectly. And you can color coordinate however you want. So I love using these and then I only have, okay, I have one of these. I think I have a couple more, but I've used a lot of these, uh, saddle page flags. I do the same thing. You can use them to highlight, to highlight, um, words or highlight something that's important. You can highlight meetings and events inside of your plans. So I use those. And then I have these, uh, matchstick transparent page flags as well. I love these. I do the same thing with these. I also use these for, see if I can find one and say, for instance, you have the priorities right here. You can take these match sticks page flags and use them as the priority. You can just write on them just like that. I got one of these for each one of my planners, one of these. So my first accessory that I have on my list are page flags. All right, coming up next 
are tab sticky notes and these oblong earl gray sticky notes i love these um, i got the tab sticky notes in linen i'm going to use those for uh, the notebooks that i have but in order to indicate um, whatever i'm working on i'll just put a page flag right here and you can also write on it you can write use it as a tab so i'll definitely use that for my notebooks especially these larger ones right here y'all in that pretty oh my gosh so i'm going to use these tab sticky notes most of all for my notebooks and these are there's a transparent and a matte and these are in linen so pretty um this oblong sticky note y'all this is the first one from look at that made in japan it's matte and i love the shape of this and so i used it um the other day when i was making my priorities right here and i just wrote down um a uh, scripture about jesus being the reason for the season i love that and y'all i'm testing out various pins on these um page flags and i used one that did not work these are some uh other ones that i like to use in my planner is the memo and then i love this one right here because i can write um make me a little list right here and y'all know if it's grid i'm making the list and i'm making this to check off sometimes when i don't want to pull my planner out i'll just pull a sticky note out put the date on here make a list of things i need to do and these are like major events so i love keeping these in um, my inbox in my planners y'all know what other sticky notes i like let me show you these two these are transparent sticky notes so when I'm trying to figure out if a layout or a new layout is going to work for me or, um, you know, what I want to write in the, in those areas, can you tell that that's a transparent sticky note? Aren't those cool? Look at that. I've used these throughout my traveler's notebooks. I've used these throughout my planners, uh, just to kind of indicate what, what do I want to try out for 2024? And next, I have some folders. So these are some fold folders I'm going to use. Y'all, we've been getting this one. If you've been getting orders, um, this one says to keep. And there's a new one that's going to come out that says moments. Isn't that great? And then I just ordered this one right here this is a mini folder and it's matte plastic go ahead and open this i usually will keep at least one of these in each in each one of my planners for various reasons all right so uh, moments for this one right here i got a one of these gratitude cards from uh, Aisha, Planner Girl Rocks. And so this is something that I felt was very important to me. And so I'm gonna keep this in the moments. I can keep it like a keepsake. I can even put it in my archive box. Have y'all seen the new boxes coming out? I haven't got my box yet, but I cannot wait to get that beautiful beautiful silver box <laughs> but you can use this to go um, in your box where you can archive it for the year special things like that when you get uh, beautiful cards from someone just saying thank you I love that and then there is a to keep section and for my to keep section for this well not to keep section for my to keep folder I'm going to use that to keep journaling cards that I love oh so much like this journaling card right here 2024 dated inserts I love this card and I have it at the front of some of my um, planners so I will keep that card in here and then this I love this saying stop measuring days by degree of productivity and start experiencing them by degree of presence so those cards that um, we get in our orders or journaling cards that you order the ones that really speak to me I just kind of keep them close to me and so I'm gonna keep my journaling cards in here and when I want to switch out journaling cards I know these are the ones I want to keep for sure and then in this plastic one right here I've decided that I will keep 
receipts, whether it's from the grocery store, whether it's from a uh, company that's going to keep receipts. So I have special cards, I have journaling cards, and then here I'm going to keep receipts. So this is a great accessory that I'm taking into 2024. All right, y'all. Next, I'm going <laughs> to show you these right here, but look at this. This is a problem. And then you don't see all the ones that I have behind me. So many pins. But I decided just to kind of share my favorites. Right now, I am into the Uniball One pins. Uh, we have this one right here. Oh my God. And this right here. I love these. And I'll, I'll indicate which one is which. I just call them Uniball One pins. But... I love the, this one, y'all. Pen test. You want a pen test? I can give you a quick pen test if you've never seen this pen before. Oh, more sticky notes. Let me get a sticky note out of here. I hate to use my sticky notes just for a pen test, but I will. Just for y'all. Y'all are worth it. This is 0 0.05. It is so dark. I love this pen. Oh my gosh. And this is, this is, what is it? 0 0.38. You can see how light, how light that is, the difference. But these pens right here, I have one just about in, <laughs> just about in all of my planners. All right, so this is a new pen that I picked up from CMP Black Friday. It's called A Little Special. So these are my pens that I love. I do have some other ones in here that I love so much too. Y'all, the Blend pen, B-L-E-N, Blend. I lost mine. It is hands down probably my favorite pen. Um, if you are a have member access from November, I just ordered five of them. That's how that's how much I love those pens. I will you will see them later in the video. They are amazing. All right, so just a couple of pens that I'm in love with right now. Uh, also, I have my Tombos. These are very important to me. As you can see, these colors are very neutral. I think right now this is the one that I grab for it's like a light gray it's the one i'm constantly using but this tan and gray and taupey colors that's what i like all right then i placed an order for clean color dots these are going to be great for tracking things in my planner this year and i got the color i think this is fawn where is it where yes fawn and Platinum. Yep. Fawn and Platinum. Love these. Then, all right, check this out, y'all. This is called uh, Friction Light. And this is a highlighter. If you didn't see this, beautiful gray highlighter. But guess what? Look at this. Okay. Excuse the shake of the table. Yep, it's gone. Erasable highlighter. Yep, by Pilot. This is amazing. This is amazing. Okay, then, I don't know if y'all, y'all should know this about me. This uh, Uniball Signo, I love to write on sticky notes. Let me see if I can find something real fast. Excuse me, not just sticky notes, black sticky notes. Here we go. So I just wrote down what the planner, catch-all planner. This, this pen right here is absolutely amazing. You see how dark it writes? Black sticky notes and this white pen. Mm -hmm. It's everything. So uh, that will continue. That's been with me for a couple of years and it's definitely staying. So these are all my pens and highlighters and 
Tombos, um, things like that, color dot pens. I'm taking all of these into 2024 with me. Okay. Let's see what's next. All right. Next, something that I cannot, I'm not going to say I can't live without, but I use them quite often. Take it into 2024, these tweezers. I love these tweezers tweezers from cloth and paper this one be very careful it is very sharp but to get those little tiny tiny stickers small stickers off tweezers are needed there we go and then you can just place them you know on your planner instead of trying to hold these little stickers with your fingers so I love these these uh, tweezers this one is more curved and this one is straight all right next oh I want to show y'all something I just got just got this with my order these are can you tell what they are watch this scissors scissors Oh yeah. Oh, I love this. I love these. Yeah, I just got these in. Look how easy that is. That is so simple. These are made by uh, Kokuyo. I picked them up from Cloth and Paper for Black Friday, but I needed some scissors just to keep in my bag because I have these big old giant scissors. These are not cute. Don't judge me, y'all. These big old giant scissors. <laughs> and I do a lot of planning and journaling and things on the go, this does not work. <laughs> so these are great. I feel judgment. I feel some judgment. So this is very important to me. All right, next, these time block stickers, I'm just going to say it. I do not time block, but I do decorate. And these time block stickers are everything. And yes, for Black Friday, I placed an order over $75 so I could get these for free. They are just gorgeous. I, I just had to have these. Look at these time block stickers. Aren't these gorgeous? And I'm, I need to go check the site, but I'm like, are these coming to the shop? Please, 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 please. Look at this color right here this one scribbled lines and those are twisted lines oh I will tell you this so I do I'm not gonna say I'm not time blocking I am going to time block a little bit for work so I purchased this year the weekly schedule to use um, for my work planner and so I was like these are too cute for work but I have some other time block stickers <laughs> but I might use them for work oh man i love these i love these okay so this is one thing some time block stickers and you saw this pouch with all of these stickers in it right these are all the spotlight stickers um oh i'm loving these i am loving these this color right here this uh manuka semicircles i love these all these are new and then i have my my other ones that are a little bit older but you see all of these yes all of these I just now started getting back into using um, a lot of these functional stickers I went through a phase and I use nothing but highlighters the next thing that I have is pouches I cannot live without a pouch so this is my essentials pouch I take this everywhere with me everywhere and it needs to be cleaned out because I've been using it but this is a pouch right here that I keep uh, the mirror in some page flags some washi tape um, a pencil and this this is the pen right here that you can use to write on the page flags let me show y'all and you don't have to worry about it I was just trying a gel pen to see if it worked it did not 
but this uni pen right here you can write on the page flags all right promise you that everyone should have one of those all right so this is one pouch that i have this is um, that's my essential pouch and then i have this nylon pencil pouch um it's kind of like a grayish green color like sage and what i love about this is it's look how wide that is it holds this is a lot of pens this is a lot of pens it holds a lot and i can add the pens that i just showed you i can add them in here as well i keep this in my uh, backpack most of the time or on my cart this is the everyday carry-on and inside of here I have more sticky notes so more sticky notes memo sticky notes and then I have a couple of pins inside of here um, do y'all remember these I love these two, these art sticky notes, Angora. I'm not even sure if cloth and paper still has them. Uh, this right here, this uh, sticky notes, um, the arched habit tracker. I tried them this year. I am going to try them again. Y'all, I'm horrible at tracking. And then once again, I have some page flags, some square page flags, and some arrow page flags. And, oh my gosh, I received something today. Are y'all ready? Are you ready for this? I'm gonna bring it in in slow motion. I'm gonna let it sit there so y'all can just think about it. <laughs> oh my gosh, I have not opened this up. I wanted to share this with y'all. This is the vegan leather pouch. I'm telling you, I think this right here is what got me pulling out all this stuff. Plus my Black Friday order. But I just got this pouch today. Oh my gosh. Come on out. Oh wow. Ooh, this is nice. As you can see, it says cloth and paper. But this is the vegan uh, leather pouch. It is free for the month of December when you purchase $150 worth of things. Isn't that nice? So it's got a um, nice pocket right here. I love this silver zipper. Take this out. Oh man. So this is making me feel like I need to replace this. <laughs> this is so nice. Oh my God, I love this. I, I love this. Okay, let me think. That's okay. I got more than one bag. I got a purse also. Y'all know, listen, us planner girls and guys, y'all know we keep all our essential things close to us. So if I had to create a brand new bag or if I had to fill this up, let's say, y'all see that? Looking good. Looking good. Isn't that pretty? Okay. I'm going to put my mirror inside of here. That's one. I'm going to take these scissors and put this inside of here oh my gosh oh my gosh all right let's see what else i think some arrow page flags maybe a square i don't think i need like everything because that's one of my problems i like to try to carry everything with me i don't need everything also i'm gonna keep one in my pouch and one in here. Let's see. I'm going to go with this black one. And I'll just put this in here. Oh, look here. Look. Oh my gosh. I didn't even see this, y'all. Look, there is a little small pocket. It's not very deep at all. It does. I'm going to leave it just like that. That's cute, right? Okay. Now, I'm going to put the scissors in here. I have these tweezers in here. I want a couple of page flags. 
Let's see what else. The noted one in here too. This is fine, right? This will be great. <laughs> I'm like, I want these in here too. I love all of these. Page flags, yes, that goes in there. All right, so now I have my clean color dots. Put those in here. Those fit. I'm gonna raise this up so y'all can see. Clean color dots fit. Let's see, does it fit a Tombow? Tombow does not fit, but my white marker does fit. I'll put me some black sticky notes in here later. And my two favorite pens, they fit in here for sure. And like this set of sticky notes for taking quick notes, this can go in here. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. Let me see what else I might need. Here's my black sticky notes. And I'm gonna close it up. Y'all, that's so nice. It's really beautiful. It's gorgeous. I love the way it feels. This is gorgeous. All right. Y'all, I think that is it. I think so. Um, let me do another little check of some accessories that I might be taking the 2024. You know what? Let me go ahead and add one more thing. I'm going to add one more thing. And that is my clips. I'm in love with my clips. I think this is a new one from Cloth and Paper. But these clips help hold me together hold everything together i love this one right here i think this is my favorite one i don't even have to clip anything to it it's just and look how strong it is i love it so i'm gonna add my clips i'm gonna stop right there y'all man thank you so much for joining me here here's another clip love the way that looks I've been setting my goals and trying to get everything figured out. So, all right, y'all, this is a different kind of video for me, sharing all my accessories, have stuff everywhere. I'm going to get off of here and I'm going to go put everything where it goes. I'm thinking with this many um, page flags that I'm going to update all of these uh, pouches and bags so I can have... Um, a little bit of everything everywhere so no matter where i'm planning i have everything that i need that's it hey let me know in the comments below what is your favorite your favorite accessories or give me your top three give me your top three accessories that you've even uh, you've either seen on here or just your top three accessories things that you're taking into 2024 all right thank you so much for joining me guys um this is uh, this is leading up to a great year all right don't forget take charge of your life one plan at a time and i'll see you on the next one